Hello there everyone, my name is Chris and today we're going to be looking at the last soldering kit from Protopic and that's the hard SMD soldering kit that allows you to assemble a nice little pendant that will beat with the pulse of a heart. First up we're going to go ahead and get all the pads prepared by adding just a little bit of solder onto one side. That way when you apply the ICs you're not going to have to worry too much about moving it around because the solder will already be there. The first parts that we're going to add are the tiny SMD LEDs and you will be able to tell which side is positive and which side is negative because there is polarity with these, either by looking at the top of the LED or at the bottom of the LED for a little green line. Using tweezers, we're just gonna go ahead and apply each of the ICs. That way it helps them reflow a lot easier. Once we have all the LEDs tacked on, we're gonna go back and add solder to the other side of the pan. Once we have all the LEDs attached, we're gonna go ahead and solder on the AT-Tiny 85. Once we solder on the Tiny 85, we're gonna move on to the cap, which is right next door. It is important to note that the capacitor, the Tiny 85, and the LEDs can be soldered on in whatever order you want, since they are all about the same size and height. Next up, we have the switch. Just a couple of SMD pads to go, and then we can move on to the battery. The battery is really handy to solder on because it does have these nice little holes in it, so that way you can actually solder through and get the solder on top to be able to have a more stable connection. And then we're gonna go ahead and add in the battery to the battery holder, make sure everything looks right. And it's okay if you need to reflow anything or rework anything, that sometimes happens. Luckily, Protopic has been kind enough to include some extra parts in case something does go wrong. Once you have everything assembled, you'll be left with this nice beating heart that'll act as a pendant if you add on your own chain or rope that you can hang from your neck or from anywhere else. So if you're looking to get into SMD soldering, refine your skills, or just wanting to learn more about it, it's a pretty good kit to pick up. And you'll be able to, you'll be left. Today we're gonna to be, today we're gonna be looking at the last, last, uh, buh, 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 buh. The heart, so, uh, buh, buh, buh.